Today, Hank and I are gonna show you how to do this messy fishtail twist updo. So, stay tuned and you will see how I do it. <laughs> okay, to start this look, you're gonna just make a low side ponytail. I just use a comb like this to pull my hair the way I want it. Make sure it's smooth in the back. And secure it with a clear hair tie. Okay, now we're gonna start the fishtail braid. You take your hair, your ponytail, and you divide it into two sections. You can smooth them out with the comb if you need to. I have layers in my hair, so I try to make sure that my ponytail sections are fairly even so that I don't have pieces sticking out. Okay, once you've divided the sections, you're going to hold them in one hand. With the other hand, you're gonna take a small section of hair from the top section and switch, transfer it over to the bottom. Then you're gonna take a small piece of hair from the bottom section and transfer it over to the left section or the top section. Again, you're gonna take a small section from the top and transfer or cross it over to the bottom. Basically, you're just taking a small section of hair from the top, crossing it over to the bottom, taking a small section from the bottom, and crossing it over to the top. Pull tightly for now when you're crossing your sections, and later we're gonna pull the braid out to make it a little looser. For this look, you're going to bring your braid as far as you can go to the end or I should say as close as you can go to the end of your ponytail. Once you're about a couple of inches from the bottom, you're gonna secure it with another clear ponytail holder. Okay, now to get any of the flyaways, I'm gonna take this mousse, it's Tresemme. It's called Flawless Curls, but it also prevents frizz, so I like to use it for that, for flyaways in my ponytails and braids. So you're just gonna put about a quarter size amount in your hand, rub it together, and then just scrunch it gently down your braid. Just like that. Your braid should look like that right now. Now I'm just gonna take the sides of the braid and gently tug it to make it a little looser. Okay, now you're gonna take the bottom of your ponytail and you're gonna pull it back and around that ponytail holder at the top. And you're just gonna keep wrapping your ends around until they come up at the back like that. I'm gonna tuck those ends under and then pin it with a bobby pin. 
like that. Use as many bobby pins as you need to secure it to your head. And then I just take a mirror and I check to make sure that I like the way it's positioned. Then I'm gonna take some hairspray. This is Tresemme. It is the maximum hold, but it's the super hold with touchable feel. I'm just gonna spray it on my hand and then run it through my hair to smooth any flyaways. Spray the whole twist and then I have really um, short layers on this on the front of my hair so just to make sure that the ponytail doesn't start falling out on the side I give it a really good spray at the back you can also use mousse the mousse that we used before, that also will smooth it. Once I'm finished, I like to finish by putting some flowers in my hair. Um, just gonna take one and slide it in. So that you can't see the bobby pin. And then I'm gonna take the second and put it in closer my ear and then just move the flowers around till you like them and you got the look you're looking for okay so this is what it'll look like when it's finished so that's it for the messy fishtail twist I hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.